DVD Bros here today, and uh, today I'm going to show you how to, well, how what to do with your homebrew channel. This is like a follow-up from my previous video. So first of all, after you get the homebrew channel, go back to your SD card and make a new folder called it app app, and then make another folder and call it WAD, which is WAD and applications. All right, now um, in the description I have. Oh, hold on one second. Try, try again. Try again. Whatever, but anyways, um, in the description I have laid out a uh, a description. Uh, in the description I have laid out a link to the Homebrew browser, and inside the zipped folder you will see another folder. It's named Homebrew Browser. So let's go back to here, and we're gonna open up the app file, and we're gonna drag the folder over here. Yes, and when you open up your Homebrew channel now, you will be able to see this. So that's good, actually. That's Yes, of course it's good. So, anyways, um, I'm gonna show you my real, um, yeah, I'm gonna show you my uh applications that I have on my homebrew channel. So here, here are all my applications. Um, yep. So, um, it works the same for just about every single one. They they start off in a zipped folder. You just have to open it, and inside will be the real folder that you have to put in the application. So, um, let's just say that I unzip the folder and the Gecko OS is in it, so I'm going to take that Gecko OS and I'm going to drag it along there, just like I did to the homebrew. So, there we go. Now it's also going to be in the homebrew. Also, for Gecko, you're also going to need the code MGR, which I have somewhere, but I'm not sure where. And, um, uh, I do not have a link where I can, where you can download it, so sorry about that. But, Yep, anyways, a uh, link for the homebrew browser is in the description. A uh, video about me getting the AC toolkit's coming soon, so heads up for that. Um, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys later.